And now, your Storm Team 18 forecast. Weather from where you live. All right. Starting off of tonight, expecting another cold night. Unfortunately, again, temperatures dropping down to the teens, but the only caveat will be the fact that the winds will be quite light throughout the course of the, of the night. So compared to last night, when it was a bit breezy. Tonight won't be as bad, but still again, another cold night with the temperatures down to 12 degrees by tomorrow morning. So even colder than last night. Temperatures all across the board looking at 10 to 14 degrees tomorrow morning. So a bit colder as you head into your Monday morning primarily due to the fact they have the clearing skies overhead, which will keep those temperatures quite low as we head towards your Monday morning. And for Monday itself, expecting a fairly cloudy day, at least for most of the day, as you're watching just a couple of flurries moving in for us. Temperatures though recovering to the upper 20s as we head throughout the course of your Monday. Those winds turning to the west northwest as we head throughout the course of the day. A bit more breezier tomorrow, tomorrow but still again, another cold day. Temperatures below the freezing mark for the fourth straight day in the row, looking at temperatures from 25 to 29 degrees for tomorrow afternoon. So again, cold day, unfortunately, as you open up the week, but winter like for this time of year in December, as again, you open up the month of December with these cold temperatures and looks like you'll see it that way for quite a while. Looking ahead to later on tonight, those clear skies in place as we head towards tomorrow morning by 730, a few clouds moving in here first thing in the morning in advance of that next system. And then as we head throughout the course of the late morning into the afternoon, seeing a couple flurries developing just southwest of Lafayette, yeah, that's actually the system actually trying to make its way in here as it will be falling apart due to encountering drier air. And with that, just looking at just a couple of flakes, so you may notice a couple of flakes falling from the sky. You may even see it as you head outside at times Monday afternoon. But again, not expecting any accumulation out of the system at all as it does completely fall apart as it does move through Monday afternoon. But behind that system, just the more lake effect snow coming off of Lake Michigan, impacting areas, especially to northeast, so Rochester, maybe up towards portions of Miami County may experience some flurries later on Monday evening and into Tuesday morning, but the majority of the area will stay nice and dry as we head into Tuesday itself, looking at clearing skies for the rest of Tuesday, so no issues, but again, cold temperatures remaining in place. And then we watch Wednesday as by Wednesday later in the day, this is eight o'clock on Wednesday evening, watching a big cold front moving through much of the nation. This cold front will bring in much colder temperatures to much of the country. Once again, could bring a couple flurries, maybe even some rain showers to our area as that front does move through and by Thursday afternoon temperatures drop like a rock back into the 20s only for highs that afternoon. So looking at a cold return to reality, unfortunately, after temperatures reaching a high of 41 on Wednesday, temperatures will again crash on Thursday due to that cold front as we'll reinforce that cold air for our area. Now continue to Friday, so remaining cold. Saturday, a couple snow showers possible and then some dry weather before some rain moves in here by the following Monday as some warmer air looks to probably look, move back in briefly, but again, behind that system, more colder air funnels right back in here that following Tuesday with some snow showers possible. So looking at again, predominantly, predominantly cold pattern as we head towards the first half of December. Again, looking at the next several days, 27 tomorrow, 32 on Tuesday, 41 on Wednesday, wintry mix possible late in the day, down to only 24. Look at this on Thursday, up to 31 on Friday, below the freezing marks for each and every day. And then 37 on Saturday, a couple snow showers possible, 41 on Sunday, and then temperatures up to 40s on Monday with some rain before some colder temperatures come right back in that Tuesday and the Wednesday with some snow showers once again.